Yuga in Hinduism is an era. There are supposed to be four eras. The first one, Treta Yuga. Treta Yuga, the second one. Dwapa Yuga and the current and final one, Kali Yuga. Now, Treta Yuga is supposed to have lasted for 1,728,000 years. Treta Yuga is supposed to have lasted for 1,296,000 years. Dwarpa Yuga for 864,000 years and Kali Yuga is supposed to last for 432,000 years. Ramayana is an epic in Hinduism and the hero Ramayana is very much revered by every Hindu, by most Hindus if not every Hindu. The hero Ram who is also considered to be the seventh incarnation of the god Vishnu is worshipped by many and his supposed birthplace Ayodhya is in North India which is also a holy place for Hindus. Now Ram is said to have existed during the second era which is Treta Yuga. Now they say that Kali Yuga started back in 3102 BCE which was also the end of Dwarpa Yuga which ended with Krishna who was the eighth incarnation of Vishnu when he ascended to his abode that time Dwarpa Yuga ended and Kali Yuga began. That was roughly 5000 years ago. Now assuming Treta Yuga ended in a similar fashion where Ram went to abode just to assume that Ram existed till the end of this era, it would have been at least 869,000 years ago. Now, archaeologically speaking, this was even before the earliest fossils of Neanderthals are dated. The earliest fossils of humanity, of evidence of anatomically modern Homo sapiens, dates back to about 300,000 years ago. Now, behavioral modernity developed around 50,000 years ago. Homo sapiens arrived in the Indian subcontinent roughly around 40,000 years ago. Bronze Age in Asia began roughly around 3300 BCE. This was when the Indus Valley civilization began and it was one of the first three civilizations in the world along with Egypt and Mesopotamia. The Aryans invaded the land around 1500 BCE and they began what we know now as the Vedic Age and then they wrote the Vedas which are the oldest scriptures in Hinduism. Certainly Ramayana which is said to have been composed just around 500 BCE is way younger than all of these old texts. Ramayana states that there were kingdoms, politics, wars, chariots, swords, helmets and other things during its period and also such is stated in Mahabharata which is another epic in Hinduism which is supposed to have occurred hundreds of thousands of years ago. The earliest records of chariots are from roughly 2000 years ago when they were also used in Mesopotamia. The Rig Veda which is the earliest Hindu record of chariots and it was written after the Vedic age began. So the time period when Ramayana is supposed to have occurred was actually the Stone Age and the archaic humans started to use stone spears to hunt and there were absolutely no chariots or kingdoms during the Stone Age. The Hindu epics are a bunch of bull. But that being said, the stories in themselves are not really that bad. As a work of fiction, pure fiction, they're kind of interesting and maybe people should give them a read just as they would do with any other fictional book. Think of them as the Game of Thrones written during the BCE. I have been Shubham of the Queer Indian Atheist. Thank you for watching. Until next time.